There we go. Let me go back to the game. Okay. <laughs> okay, um so what time are we at? And what time's food supposed to be coming? So about an hour then. Yeah. That works. So as soon as the food gets here I'll stop. Uh, so it looks like a bean bag. It's rubbish. Uh, it's rubbish then in a bag. Yeah, it's yeah. rubbish in a bag. Um, right, so we'll go get our minerals. We'll chuck some of those minerals into the back of the feeder, and we've just got our money. Good, which it helps. Right, let's get rid of that. I don't want that happening too much now. Uh, let's get rid of those. I'm trying to trying to get help, but not too much help. Right, sell that one, yes. And we'll sell one of those, and we'll just keep one. So we'll get a 350 an hour subsidy. Right. Um. Well that kind of helps, because now we can get. While we're on our way down there, we need, we need, oh, what's that? Oh. Um. Ooh. Okay, that's kind of interesting. Um, back. We'll get one of those at some point. Um, we need two things. I'll take I'll take that trailer with me. Yes, that's uh, in fact. Um, let's go and have a look. Yes. Yeah, I still have that on. I thought that was off. Automatic. So why aren't you moving? There we go. Right, we'll shift this out of the way. My monster. Freaking monster truck. Look at the turning circle on this thing, it's ridiculous. Right, jump out, and let's go run over to our tractor. Right, so we should be able to pull, we should be able to hook some onto the back of that. So let's move this. Off there. And we will go down and we will get. Right, we want. What's this? The heck is that? Oh my god, what the heck is that? I have no idea. It's got a conveyor on the back. I have no clue what that is.
Huh. Yeah, most of the machines in this game are real. Mine's just huge. That is just massive. Right. Huh. Wow. So it's it's cutting the it's cutting the grass itself, isn't it? Or corn. Or corn. Take the chaff and the corn silage and mix it. That's that's munching that. And throwing it in there, and they basically. Wow. Wow. How much was that? <laughs> <laughs> three hundred and thirty-eight, three hundred and twenty-eight thousand. Three hundred and twenty-eight thousand. But the real one's probably quite a mil. <laughs> Right, so what I need is, I need a bucket, um, front load of tools, I need one of these I think, let me see, uh, what's that? That looks like it's got a motor of some kind on it. Hmm. And definitely rotates. Uh, okay, back. Let's just get a standard bucket. Now, do I want a silage one or just a normal bucket? Actually, what does that one do at the end? Uh, it does all of it. Alright, so that's what? Three, thirty, three, twenty-three hundred litres. And that's, okay, that's better. But that's more expensive, way more expensive. Why is that so expensive? <laughs> Why, yeah, why is the rum always gone? Oh. Ah. Uh. Ooh. Um. Okay. I guess we'll get that one. Buy that. Yes. And back, and we are going to run back again. And we're going to get that straw thing. Animals, animals, animals. Animals. Straw shredder. Amount of stuff I'm buying is ridiculous. Right. Let's go. So we're hooked up. Got the forks. All right, let's go get what we need from them. Oh, oh, we've got we've got some wool. Did 
Did I just see some naked sheep? No. I thought I saw some naked sheep then. Yeah, they're definitely not naked. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so if that's, I wonder if my bees have pr produced any honey yet. Well, they shouldn't be really. In theory, they shouldn't be making honey in September, because they're usually prepping to to hibernate at this time of year. But I'll go check as soon as I picked up these two items that I've got to go and get. Actually, three items. Is it three items? Yeah, three items. Is it going to let me hook this up? Ah, oh, damn pole. Why? Why? Who designs a map and then sticks a, tele a light pole in the way? Let's turn it around and we'll put this over here a minute. Uh, drop that off. Right, grab the pallet. Grab the pallet. Where is the pallet? in the wrong place Euro pallet let's pick this thing up Mm -mm. Okay. Right. Let's 
drop this onto here. Um, G. Jump out. Let's go and strap them on. Grab our bucket. And hook this up. And I bet I can't get this to hook up onto that trailer. Please let that hook up onto that trailer. Oh, yes, awesome, let's go, let's just save me a trip, everything in one run. That train comes here, comes through this town way too often. <laughs> you know, it, what it sh really should do is have that come through every so often and have an actual passenger train come through and actually stop in the station rather than just having a, 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 a train that just doesn't actually do much. It just drives through. I know you can rent that train and everything, but it would be more immersive if there was actually um, mm. Oh crap Come on Let's go um, If there were an actual passenger train that served this town Right, so, we're going to need another barn, just for the cow stuff. Okay, let's drop that, let's drop that there, and we'll pull this trailer through here. <laughs> My stuff we've got. It's just ridiculous. Um, I really do need another barn. Let's see if we can buy one. I'm trying to get a small... I, I only really need a small one. Hmm. Where's the doors? Um, if I put it... If I put it there... No. Let's see if we can put it this way.
car, it actually would have fit there. Oh, it fits there, but I don't want it there. I kind of want it. I'd like it to go there. Hang on, did that work? It would work if I actually moved those vehicles out of the way. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's that one, in it? It is. Right, let's just drop... Um, no, forward. Let's go over here with it. You know what? Let's take it out front. Um, what if I can push this thing out of the way? What's that? Okay. Let's remove the glitch from my farm. <laughs> I pushed it over there. <laughs> Well, the, it shouldn't be in that. It shouldn't be here. Uh, no, because the front half of it went. Because that actually sat on top of the power. There was a power power harrow underneath it. So, and that's the seeding. That's the seeding implement that sits on top. When I sent the when I returned the items, it only sent back the harrow and left the cedar here. And, I can't use it without the harrow. I can't use it, and, and if you, if I buy, it, if you buy it, you buy it as one unit. It comes as a package. <laughs> so it should have gone as a package, but instead, it's part of it stayed. Anyway, let's chuck this shovel over here for now, because we're gonna, we're gonna be scooping up this hay at some point, so we may as well just leave it over here until we need it. Um, front, empty, uh, let's reverse back. We're going to hook onto, no we're not, we was, but we're not now. <laughs> I was going to hook onto that, but we need to put a, a bar up, don't we? We need to deal with this barn situation let's go and do that so i need to get some of this stuff put away really need some of this stuff put away right so let's grab the treader get it moved so i'm thinking if we can if we um get another barn of actually putting all of the um hang on Steer the right way. Um, of putting all of the uh, like the treader, the windrower, the baler, the bale wrapper. Um, Let's move it over. In fact, I think it would be safe if I put it here in this corner for now. And let's go and get that other thing out of the way. I think I've put all the, the field stuff that makes bales and things in one barn. 
so we will need to move this one as well, won't we? Oh, this is rough. This is rough. This land is rough now. I'm going to have to flatten that out a little bit. Okay. And we'll pull that forward. We'll just pull that over here. And leave it there. Let's turn around and grab that baler. Can I stick that in there? Or is the bales it the bales are in the way? Well, we'll just pull it out of the way for now. We'll leave it on the back. Right, let's no. Leave it on the back. Jump out and we'll go and take a we'll stand on the rear and see if we can get that that barn in here. So it was this one, wasn't it, I was gonna use. And it fits, sort of, in that spot. Um, how many can I fit in here? Do you think I could get two of them in here? Like one there. One there, maybe. And then one right next to it. <laughs> I know I'm burning the money again, but See now. Uh, this is definitely going to need to be flattened a little bit, I think. Well, sloped actually. Construction, landscape. Um, slope. Good. Right. So that should work for that area over here. Uh, I'm going the wrong way.
All right, let's see if we can just get it in there now. Wow, that took some getting in. That's one. Right, let's turn around and let's get um square. I wonder if I can flatten that out a little bit. Hang on. Okay, that that kind of works. That slope's pretty good. Um. Hopefully that looks okay. Right, um can, can we actually get one of these in there? I'm not sure if I can get that in into one of these. Well it might fit just That's better. That's a better slope. Let's see what this is like going this way. Eh. That's okay, I guess. This bit's going to be a bit. Yep. Okay, let's see if we can get this this trailer into one of these barns. Um, now, not exactly sure which is going to be the best one to try and put. It's probably the end one over here might be the easiest to deal with. I think. Well, uh, oh, it's one of those. Uh, I don't like these kind of trailers. Nope. Nope. Mm -mm. Let's have a look, see if we can get a better one. I want a fixed one. I don't want this. I'll get rid of it and, and buy another one. Uh, bail loaders, nope. Uh, bail trailer, it might be a bail loader, wouldn't it? That's a swivel, isn't it? 
Yep, it is. Surely there's a rigid one. That's swivel. There isn't. Oh my god, there isn't. Okay. Um, let's go up here then. Surely there's one up here that's a flat. Absolutely not. Okay, I'm going to be waiting on modders to get me a flatbed with a rigid, rigid hookup. Can we actually configure that? Uh, nope. Chassis colour, nope, we can't configure it. Um, how about this one? Nope. Um, can I, can I mess, mess with that one? That looks like it's a, a pivot as well. Nope, we're not messing with that, even though I could configure it. But that's a pivot in it. Can I configure this one then? That's a pivot. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Hmm. Maybe, maybe I may have to go with a low loader. There's a flatbed. Well, I really don't need one that long. This one might be better. But that <laughs> that's got a swivel. What? Oh, how about this one? Oh. Okay. And what's that hooking? How's that getting moved around? Is that a three pin or what? How's that moving? vehicle goes with that. It's not actually showing a combination, is it? Um, that doesn't look like it's a three pin either. I don't know what I don't know what vehicle uses that. Okay. Time we up. Yeah. 
it's almost time. So, um, okay, so this tra trailer isn't going to reverse very easily into there. I know for a fact it's going to twist around. Yep, yep. So let's just pull this over here, stick it behind the barns, and pretend it's not even there. <laughs> to keep, I'm going to chop this tree down I think and we'll hide this trailer sort of actually if we pull it through um, or oh not because there's a tree in the way you know what let's chuck it over here Leave it there for a minute. And we will grab. Let's. Let's grab. Uh, let's grab this. Quickly. I want to quickly demonstrate this straw thing before we call it a day. Did he run past us? Yeah. Still in. Let's grab the other one. I don't know where I put the other one. Huh. Alright, let's just up that up and throw that in there, I think. Right, so let's see what that did for the cows. A little bit of straw. We've got some some slurry coming out, and we've got milk. We still need some grass, and we still need some mixture. So we've got what um, total mixture is hundred percent. 
effectiveness, which that can't be right because we haven't really got a mixed mi mixed rations in there. Um, hay of eighty percent and grass of forty percent, which makes that one hundred and twenty percent. Yeah. Um. Our cows are growing. Our cows are. How much did we pay for them? Um, I think we paid what a thousand, thousand, ten, thousand and ten, I think. So they're already making a profit. Hmm. Okay, so that was the straw being thrown in. Um, I don't know where that other bale is. There it is. Let's just pull this over here. Like so. Unhook it. Okay, the first two days of streaming this. Um, am I impressed with the game? I think so. I think it looks pretty good. They've done okay with the weather. The, the rain could be a bit better, a bit, bit more graf graphically... Um, and realistically done, but it's not. It, it, the bane doesn't come down like that. Um, it hitting the roof of the vehicle, yeah, that sounds pretty good. Um, I quite enjoy, I'm quite enjoying it. I'm liking building my farm up. Um, I still think they should. <laughs> work on being able to do the dynamic ground. I don't care what, the, what how hard it is. Other companies have, have been able to do it, so should they. Um, I'm always going to get on at that. But am I enjoying it? Yeah. Can't wait for the mods. Let's move this. Oh, I'm going to need a slurry tanker. Hmm. Another thing for the cow shed. So we are going to call it a day. Oh, it's going to be a lot of, a lot of, um, that only takes water. Okay. Um, Milk. Uh, we need something that will carry milk. And slurry tanks. Slurry tankers. Okay. So that will work with that. 
so we'll, we'll probably get one of those um, might have to start venting some of this stuff um, let me see milk I'm not seeing anything maybe it's under animal animal transport maybe no nope. that's actual animal transport not goods aha water um yeah milk nope That milk. Anyway, till next time. I hope you've all enjoyed, enjoyed watching me play Farm Simulator later 2022. Until next time, you all have a wonderful rest of your evening.